What's up guys, welcome back to Sinister Bunny Studios and welcome to something a little bit different. Today, I'm going to be checking out the Archetype Nolly plugin from Neural DSP. Alright you guys, so you can see out in front of you right now, you see the program, the plugin, and uh, you see an amplifier right in front of you. Uh, basically what this is, is a set of amplifiers and cabinets and effects and crazy other stuff all packed into a cool program slash plugin for you to use uh, either just from your desktop as a program that I'm doing right now or as a plugin in your recording software. Uh, and basically what it is, is amp and cabinet simulators. Uh, Neural DSP makes a lot of digital plugins that do a really good job. They collaborated with Adam Nolly Get Good and uh, created these based off of modified amplifiers of his own. So let's kind of take a look at the, the layout of it at first. So uh, all the way to the left here, and the, technically the first side, all the way to the left, you've got your pre-effects, you've got a compressor, two overdrives, and a delay pedal, which is really nice to have. Uh, if you move on over to the next section, that's where the amplifier and cabinets were. And take note, at the bottom here, you see the four amps and four cabinets in these little symbols. Um, and you'll notice when I switch back and forth, they're kind of paired. They don't have to be. You can click this little circle above it and unlink them, and you can mix and match however you want. You can have amp one with cabinet three, amp three with cabinet one, and so on. You can mix and match however you want. And um, basically, the first pair of amp and cabinet is a clean tone. The second one's more of a crunch tone. The third is more of a rhythm, a little bit heavier on the gain. And uh, the last one is more of a lead tone. But you can use them however you want to. It's just kind of that's, that's how it's set up initially. Um, if you move on to the next section at the top, you've got an EQ. Next section over, you've got your cabinet and speaker uh, whole section. So you've got uh, uh, the ability to use two microphones at once, and um, you can't see the drop-down menu, but you have a list of different microphones you can use. You have a 57, you have a 421, a condenser, 4, uh, 414, you've got a ribbon, and you can also load custom impulse responses of your own or from any other place that you've downloaded them from and load them up into here and uh, increase the range of sounds that you can get. And another thing to know about this section is you can actually click and drag the microphones down on the interface and place them wherever you want and hear the sound change in real time as if you were miking up a cabinet in real life and trying to find the sweet spot. So that's another really cool thing. And uh, next on the end over here, you've got like the effects loop section, uh, your post effects, and you've got another delay and a reverb pedal which are really nice to have. So you get a lot of cool features packed into this whole plugin slash program. And, uh, you know, y you can make your own tone and there's endless possibilities to do so. Um, so there's not much else beyond that that I want to note. You, I could dive into this for hours because there's so much packed into this program and plugin, um, but I don't want to do that. I'll keep it short for you guys so you could give it a taste. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go through some of the presets that Nolly made for this and give you a test of what it sounds like. So let's go over here to Nolly and let's check out the first preset called Air Raid. Right now I'm in drop A sharp with my Schecter Avenger and a thing to note, uh, the playing might be a little weird and off. Uh, because of the way that I have to record the audio coming from this program through OBS, it creates some latency issues. There are not latency issues with the program itself, the Archetype Nolly. It's just the jerry-rigged way I have to set up the inputs and outputs to be able to record the audio. So there's a little bit of lag on my end, but in the program there's not. So let's check out Air Raid. Very nice, very nice heavy tone. Let's check out, let's check out ambient breakup. This will be more of a clean section. Um, let's see what we can do here. Let's, uh, let's get a little bit of ambience going.
So that's really cool. You can make a bit of an atmospheric vibe. Um, let's see, we got Articulate Lead. Let's check that out. Very nice lead tone. See what else we got here. I'm not going to go through every single one of these, but I'll pick out a few notable ones. Uh, they're all really, really good. That's Future Chug Machine. Very, very chuggy. Uh, next, let's check out, let's check out Liquid Shred, another lead tone here. Another good lead tone. Uh, let's check out a couple more. Let's look at let's look at Modern Misery. That's one of my favorites. Very chunky. Very, very chunky. Okay. Um, ooh, we got a pristine clean. Uh, a bit of a hiss there. Interesting. Let's check out this pristine clean. Hmm. Interesting. Very cool, very cool. And now let's check out the D word. Yeah, let's check out the D word, see what that sounds like. Man, this lag is killing me, it's latency. Another very chunky tone. The D word, I'm assuming that's for gent. And uh, let's check out let's check out vulgar display. I'm assuming that's kind of like a Pantera play on words. Yeah, if I had my guitar tuned in the standard, I would play some vulgar display of power. But a very Pantera esque tone. Nice, I like it. I like it.
let's just, we'll check out one more. Let's look out Washed Out. What's this song? Oh. Okay, uh. That's a very interesting one. Oh, a lot of delay on that one. Interesting. As you can see, you can power it off of that power button as well. That's very interesting. Very, very interesting. Okay. All right, so that's enough playing for me. Uh, <laughs> There is a lot of presets, a lot of versatility with this plugin and program. There's a lot you can do with it. And the, the possibilities are almost limitless because you can mix and match amplifiers, load your own IRs, you can adjust all the dials on the amplifiers, you can do different pre and post effects, you can mess with the EQ, you can mess with the microphone setup on the cabinet, move the microphone around on the cabinet. So it's just, there's a lot you can do with this and I've been messing around with this plugin a lot and been re recording some songs and stuff with it so you guys will definitely hear this on a lot of my stuff coming up because i figured it was a lot better to drop the money for something like this which i can get some really good tones out of instead of trying to spend 10 times as much getting real amplifiers and stuff and still not really being able to capture the sound correctly because of the environment that i live in um, i will still get physical amplifiers in the future but this is a really amazing tool to have for songwriting recording and just practicing in general um, it's very very well put together the sounds are very authentic uh, I, I noticed almost no latency when I'm playing with it and just the the, the, the the amount that you get in this whole package is just it, it blows my mind and Adam Nolly get good and neural DSP did an amazing job with this plugin it was very very much worth the money and uh, I think it's about 150 bucks US. It's like 135 pounds or something like that. Um, uh, you know, over on the other side of the pond, and uh, it comes out to about 150 bucks. I think is what I paid for it. Um, I think it's well worth it. It's definitely, definitely well worth it. And not to mention, if you can quickly find really amazing tones with those presets. And if you don't exactly like a preset, you can just go to that preset and adjust all the different criteria for it that you want to make it more of what you want out of your tone. You know, it can give you a good starting point. So this whole plugin is really, really amazing. And like I said, you guys are going to hear a lot of it on a lot of my stuff coming out. And uh, it, it allows you to record quietly. It gives you a good sound pretty much right away. Uh, and it's just, like I said, it's amazing. And I'm surprised that it is this amazing. I've used amp simulators and cabinet simulators in the past with IRs and haven't had the best results with them because they can sound very fake and digital. But these, these, this program is just phenomenal. So if you're looking to not spend a lot and get a lot of good tones and a multiple amplifiers with a lot of effects and some crazy shit for you to record with, the Archetype Nolly from Neural DSP is an amazing, amazing program and plugin. So if you want it, definitely go pick it up if you got the cash. But I think that's it. I think I've mentioned everything that I need to. Hopefully, I've shown you guys enough of what this thing can do. And uh, let me know what you think of it because it's it's an amazing thing. And programs like this are starting to break new ground and they're coming really, really far. So uh, it's cool to see that's come this far and it'll be cool to see where it goes from here. So I think that's it for this video. And like I always say, thank you guys so much for liking, commenting, and subscribing, and sharing all of my videos. And I'll see you guys in the next video. I'm going to continue to jam, so I'll see you guys later.